Hello everybody, this is Stephen from Husky to Healthy on YouTube. Uh, today it's Easter. Happy Easter to everybody. Um, it was a nice day. Tomorrow starts my 10-day countdown to my surgery and my 10-day start of all-liquid diet. Am I happy about it? No, but in preparation I went ahead and just got done. I'm sweating like a field hand here because uh, I threw away all my bad food out of the refrigerator and, uh, because my plan beforehand was to eat all my bad food beforehand, but didn't quite get all the way through it. So uh, I threw away all my junky food, my bad food, food that I know that I can't eat while I'm on the liquid diet. I think the only thing that's in the refrigerator right now are like... Asian food condiments, uh, ketchup, low-fat mayonnaise, uh, country crock, and some olive oil, butter, uh, my milk, and uh, milk in my water bottles. And then in my freezer I have bananas and strawberries and vodka, but I won't drink the vodka, and some uh, garden burger stuff and basically ice packs and ice. So uh, everything's cleaned out of there. As far as my pantry, I'm going to do that tomorrow. I don't think there's anything that I'm going to... It's going to be a really great temptation that I need to get out of the refrigerator. Most of the stuff I threw out was stuff that was going to... that was perishable anyway. Um, and so I start my liquid fast tomorrow. Uh, I had my last supper. Um, suppers that I'm sure we all go through. Uh, what I really wanted to do was go to this place called uh, Nalor down here, which is a Chuscaria, which basically is a Chilean restaurant where they basically just walk around with meat that was cooked on spits. And so it's like a meat orgy, pretty much. And I was like, you know what? Um, after I have this done, I'm not going to be wanting to spend 35 or $45 to... Uh, to... Uh, to have like three ounces of meat, you know, so, um, but I didn't do that, A, cost factor, and B, uh, I didn't really think that I needed to be that gluttonous, uh, although it's interesting though, I was listening to some people who said they've been going back to Chinese food buffets, which I know that's going to be hard for me, and, um, you know, they had mentioned something about they showed their card, and then they got a discounted buffet, um, I don't know what that is. Uh, when I go see my doctor this Wednesday, I'll ask him what that is. Maybe it's a card that says that you've had weight surgery and if, and that I don't need a full portion. And I, I don't know. If y'all know something about that, let me know. But um, I had a Monte Cristo, which was uh, one of my... I know I'm never going to be able to have this after uh, my diet, cause it's, or after I have my vertical sleeve, because basically it's French bread with turkey and ham and Swiss cheese deep fried with uh, with uh, strawberry preservatives and you know um, a, I don't think that's the smartest choice and B I don't think that my stomach will deal with um, all that food so I had that and surprisingly it was really disappointing uh, it wasn't just the best one that I ever had and I was like Oh, maybe I was expecting it to be great. And then last night I went to go have Mexican food, and it was a really, really nice dinner. And then today I woke up early, and I wanted, what I really wanted was French bread, French toast, I mean. But uh, instead I just got up early, went to McDonald's, had their deluxe big breakfast, and uh, and then for lunch, lunch and dinner, I went over to a friend's house, and we made vegetarian fajitas, and I had flour tortillas, because, you know, flour tortillas are going to be out, and uh, that was about it, um, the, we also had some chocolate brownies, but they didn't come out, they were pretty burnt, so we really didn't get to, to eat too much of them, but uh, yeah, that's where I'm at, tomorrow the 10 day liquid diet starts, um, I'm actually going to start off in the morning, because I know I'm going to need something a little heavier in my stomach, so I'll have a protein scoop 
with uh, a frozen banana and frozen strawberries with fat-free milk for breakfast. And then for lunch, I think for lunch I might actually do like tomato soup just tomorrow because it'll be the first day. And uh, then for dinner, I'll have another protein shake with banana and strawberry. And then the rest of the week, I'll probably wind up doing um, the same thing for breakfast and dinner. But I'll probably be doing the AES uh, protein shake things. Um, I actually have some kike powdered, uh, powdered drinks. I may do some of those also just so I can see which one I would like best. Uh, but... Yeah, that's the game plan. Uh, Ten days till I have surgery. Um, I'm just kind of exhausted right now. The house in my hands smell like bleach. My allergies are bothering me. That's another thing is I'm kind of... I need to talk to my doctor tomorrow and call and be like, what exactly do I need to wean out? Because I take a Allegra every night for the allergies because pollen is so bad here. But I kind of all last week did half doses. And then Friday... Uh, Thursday and Friday I did no doses and my nose has been killing me so I did a full one this morning but I just want to make sure that everything will be fine with the anesthesia because I do want to wake up and live um, so yeah that's about it wish there was something more exciting to say um, I'm planning to probably work about 10 days straight um, to save time for um, to use the weekend hours towards time off I'm taking for my surgery so uh, I can have some more vacation time to use because I'm only going to be taking off about 12 days but yeah I'm, I'm rambling so I hope everyone had a wonderful Easter I hope you had a lovely time with your family um, thanks for all the uh, the great comments and emails that y'all send me um, and I hope that y'all have a good week and I uh, will talk to you later Hi, this is Steven for Husky to Healthy on YouTube.